What's up guys, Liam here and welcome back to LSJ TV. So, this video I actually filmed around about three months ago. Uh, I held on to it in, in the hope that they were going to release that red, white and blue stripe thing here in the UK. That never ended up happening. Um, and so obviously you know that I've done work with Predator in the past, I was hoping that they could send... It, it never ended up happening. Anyway, so this video is about three months old. Um, I've lost about £12 in body weight since and um, was actually playing a game of who could grow the sh** beard with a friend of mine and um, I won. You'll know what I mean when we get into the video. So if you are excited, please drop the video a like, comment down below and subscribe if you are new. Welcome to the family. Thank you for tuning in today and enjoy the video. I literally don't even know where to start. Nah, it's, it's got to be the white, isn't it, to be fair? Damn it. <sighs> What's up guys, Liam here. And welcome back to LSJ TV. So, traditional taste tests and stuff I just spat everywhere. <laughs> Traditional taste test, live taste test, and all that kind of stuff. Um, honestly, I'm, I'm really not a massive fan of it on the basis that you feel almost like the pressure to, to say, oh, this is such a good product, I love it. And even if that is your genuine opinion, people kind of don't believe it, and I do, I, I understand that. And so I figured what I would do for this video is start with a couple that I've already tasted, like the white and stuff like that, but rather than being in there, I usually do videos like this in there, with them all laid out on the table, open like seven, which would be a waste, by the way, sip on them, say, yep, yep, that tastes like the white one. Yep, that tastes like the red one. I figured what I would do instead is have one a day, a different flavour a day, for a week. And that's that, that's how this is gonna work. Good job, I've got this 3D to keep me going with 200 milligrams of caffeine per can. Yeah. On a serious note, though, I'm at the minute I'm using it as an appetite suppressant, like caffeine. <coughs> so, you know. Oh yeah, I've got that for you. Great, thank you. Got it, thanks. Do you need sign or? No. Okay, thanks. Day two, breakfast is here. So a couple days ago, we realized we were running out of protein, stocked up on some ghost. The only ones I've actually tried, oh God, are, Peanut butter, cereal milk, and um, regular cereal milk. And so myself and the old man decided to try pancake batter, yes, and the cinnamon cereal milk. So it was at this moment he knew he fucked up. Oh god! Now I am most excited for the pancake batter. Um, I actually didn't realise for quite a long time that this was available in the UK, um, but here it is. Ha! <laughs> That's mad! Oh, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. 
Okay, so anyone who has followed the channel for a while will know that if I have oats or something like that in the morning, just generally breakfast, um, I like to wash it down with a bit of orange juice. I figured I've never tried the orange flavoured 3D. And so I know it's not a replacement, I'm not saying don't drink orange juice and go and like buy a 3D or vice versa, right? But, I figured it'd be interesting, you know? Oh, that's two days in a row! I've heard Okay. Interesting, right, okay. I heard that it was like, you know, a Fanta, a Tango, that kind of taste. And I don't normally like that. I don't like the orange flavor of other competitors, shall we say. Um, and I just generally don't like fizzy orange stuff. I love flat, you know, orange squash. I love orange uh, juice, what I would normally have with breakfast. But this, because it's less carbonated and stuff, it's all right. Only all right though, it wouldn't be my favorite. Okay. Mm. Come on, third time lucky. Third time lucky. Ah! Yes. Next option, the blue. Honestly, I, I, I'm pretty sure this is like a blue raspberry flavor. I'm pretty sure that this is my favorite and that's very hard for me to say. I've had this before, I've had this a few times. I've not had it for months. I've not had any 3D for months. It can be uh, quite difficult to get hold of in the UK anyway, at times. Obviously a massive lover of the white. But I really, really like blue raspberry stuff. Is it blue raspberry? Next up. Haircut. We also have the green one to accompany us. And there she is. Hello, my love. Hello. Freaking thing. So right up behind me is Coach House. If you follow me through university, in particular through second year, you will know all about Coach House, the place of Liam's dreams. Um, I absolutely loved every single second of living there. You are literally across the street from Nottingham, across the street from all the action, whether that be a restaurant, a nightclub, you know, any, literally anything, a gym, a cafe, I don't know, anything that you could want, it's like two minutes that way. So the landlord actually owns all of this, and this kind of little section here on the second floor was ours. That was the kitchen, my bedroom, and Charlotte's bedroom, and the front door just around there. And the whole time that I had there really put everything kind of into perspective, you know. I always went to uni with the mindset of being appreciative of everything, you know, living in the moment and all of that kind of cliche stuff for, for various reasons, like things that were happening. And I was just like, right, I'm going to go and I'm going to live and I'm going to enjoy it, you know. Um, but living there in particular really put everything into perspective, sort of how fortunate, how lucky I actually was to be living there it's like a two three million pound building and i was living there for like 120 pound a week like what in a city center that i absolutely love with like surrounded by friends and my family still literally just down the road it's like it was absolutely amazing and i just paid one hour's car parking so i could park and show you that so i hope you enjoyed it and drop the video i like you know because that just cost me some money Oh, it was great living there, man. It was unreal. Let me know in the comments if you remember the coach house days. <laughs> I bet no one remembers. I bet you no one comments. Hair before. Very long. Now there is nothing, nothing better than a fresh trim. Boom!
calcine trim acquired it's already been a successful day let's go home and train with cam the cameraman yes hey cam try this it's like literally empty yeah well, i saved you the last sip is it caffeine yeah mate it's half seven just drink it What flavour is it? I, I have no idea. What flavour do you think it is? Something sweet in it, right? Well, yeah, but it's blue. Is it blue raspberry? Is it like... There's a bit of blue raspberry in it. You reckon? Yeah. Out of ten? Standard. <laughs> They've gone to get toys. <laughs> Really? Whoa! Okay, so, the purple. Cheers. <laughs> yep, that tastes like the purple one. Yep. Try it. T tastes like the purple one, doesn't it? Yeah. It has a taste. <laughs> it does have a taste, you're right. Purple. Have you ever had Grape Fanta? That's what it tastes like. Grape Fanta? Mm -hmm. Okay, I've never had Grape Fanta. Or like Fanta. grape fla flavoured stuff. It's like sweet. You know like when you have like tang fast sticky sweets and then after you've had the sweet there's like a tanginess in your mouth? Because they're yeah. so fizzy. Yeah. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. But it tastes like grape flavoured stuff. I can see that. Grab. I quite, I quite like that. Yeah, it's nice. Very sweet though. If you don't like sweet, sweet drinks, then it wouldn't be the one for you. Yeah, that's the point. I... Uh, hold that a sec. I really like sweet stuff. Like, I have a real sweet tooth. I could demolish, you know, a ton of uh, candy in, in one sitting mm. and not even really be phased. Um, whereas you're not quite like that, are you, babe? Um, no. but that's, that's, that's nice. I'd probably put that at number... Hang on. It tastes like the purple monster. So these are the ones we've had so far. I would definitely put probably these two at the top, followed by this one. So that would put this one at number four, and then the orange one at the bottom. Now this is completely unrelated to today's video, but I just have to say, oh my goodness, I have pulled it out of the bag with tonight's dinner. Muscle food, chicken, half a packet of rice, ton of veg, ready for Love Island. Boom. Hello, hello, hello. Good all mate. I'm ready to get some breakfast. Yeah? And maybe a monster or seven. <laughs> it's currently 9.22 a.m. And uh, it's far too early for future teacher Jake to be going to the gym. Oh, oh that just went everywhere. It's one thing about 3Ds, right? They seem to go everywhere because they are actually full. You get other energy drinks and they fill them to like here. Yeah, there's no chance of it kind of going everywhere, but at least you get a full can of, of drink. Red one, save this till last. And I've just taken my first sip now and remember that it is my, my least favorite one. I mean, it's okay, but it's a bit like, it's a bit of a strong kind of cherry taste. Which is just not for me really, but. I still like it though, that's the thing. I could quite happily drink any of them. Yeah, I have my favourites and stuff, but that's definitely at the bottom, definitely. You know when you keep pressing the snooze on your alarm? Yeah. Five minutes, five minutes, five minutes, and you realise, oh shit, Liam's outside in 45 seconds. Try this. Oh, I think it's always important to smell a drink first. Yeah. It's 
weird. Be one. honest. Initially, no. Yeah. No. No? It's my least favourite. It's like Purple Monster slightly. The purple one's great, you know. What, Pur Purple 3D? Purple 3D is really good. Nah. I enjoy it. I will quite happily drink it. But well, you do have the fire crates with that. But I would much rather have another colour. What would your favourite colour be? Probably the blue one. What's that? The like? blue one's real good. It's like, like, like a blue raspberry. Like a blue monster? No, not like a blue monster. Blue monster is kind of like blue, uh, blue bubble gum, whereas I would describe blue 3D as blue raz. So, because as I mentioned at the start of the video, this was filmed a while back. This is actually all that remains of um, the whole stash that you guys saw in the fridge. Um, I kept these literally for the thumbnail. Uh, and as time went on, and I had more and more of them, um, I decided that these two were definitely at the top, blue and the white. Um, followed by a tie of the green and the orange. As the orange went on, I definitely enjoyed more of the orange. Um, followed by the purple and the red. Um, I'm afraid it just has to go dead bottom, dead last. No real competition for me. Wouldn't you agree, Mum? That white is at the top with blue. What do you mean? Favourite colours, of course. No. Purple. Orange. Purple. Have you, even, have you tried any of them? You haven't, have you? Okay, well anyway, my review is solid. It is in stone and the only correct one on YouTube. So if you've enjoyed the video, drop it a like, comment down below, subscribe if you're new. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Can you see? I can see your eyes and your nose. <laughs> Can you see my mouth like that? Yeah, but not your hair. Is it clear that I'm surprised? <laughs> like. like acting? No, that's a bit much. <laughs> How about... <gasps> <laughs>